Okay, people, I think I'm recording. I'm sitting in the poet's corner in the parochial gardens, walking Ruby, and there's the magnificent uh, St. Bridget's Ch Catholic Church in Oldcastle, uh, home of the singing priest, Father Ray Raymond Kelly, Ray Kelly, uh, star of what do they call it? Um, Dancing with Stars in Ireland and millions of views on YouTube. Hallelujah. The singing priest, Father Ray Kelly. And I'm sitting here thinking a lot. I've cried over my mother's death here and, you know, cried over a lot of stuff. But I'm thinking of the Kellets, the Sheridan girls. Poetry was written about them. And there was a man called Tom Caffrey. And he was the owner of Caffrey's Foods, Millbrook. And uh, I had the privilege of seeing in the new year one time till four or five in the morning. I think it was in his home. I don't know where it was, but like somehow I ended up at a New Year's party and it was a proper Irish Cayley. And Tom Caffrey had the most beautiful voice and he sang. We all did a party piece. And Jean Sheridan was his wife. I had worked with her establishing a kindergarten and funding it. Um, and she was lovely. She had a daughter, Orla, who, who had to be peeled off of her to go to school each day hysterical I don't know if she was on the autistic spectrum or what was going on but she just hated going to school and it was traumatic for Jean to drop her off every day she's probably a genius she's probably you know university graduated now and then the Sheridan the Sheridan family there were 17 children and one of them is Anne Sheridan uh now Anne Kellett wife of Tosh Kellett, mother of Darren and Bobby and Nicole. And when I got unexpectedly pregnant in America in 1985, Anne Kellett and my mother probably, like if my mother was still alive, she'd be 88, Anne Kellett's probably 70 something. They had been on protests against abortion in Ireland back then in the 80s. And when I, when, when I said to my mum, and she said to Anne Sheridan, or Anne Kellett, nay Sheridan, Angela was going to have a, an abortion, but she, she she's changed her mind, she had a dream. Anne Kellett, nay Sheridan, sent me a care package in America. And it was simple things like, I don't know, a luxury duvet set, and I don't know, it was just things like you'd have in a layette or in a... I don't, it was just beautiful, beautiful presence from the heart. And between my mother and Anne Kellett, nay Sheridan, they encouraged me to go through an unplanned pregnancy in America all alone. Tom Caffrey, owner of Millbrook Foods, married to Jean Caffrey, nay Sheridan, one of 17 children, like my father's family. When it came to his funeral, I think he committed suicide. Uh, 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 you can correct me if I'm wrong. When it came to his funeral, a whole new family turned up. An English wife and children born to Tom Caffrey. And it was so embarrassing to this small rural Irish town, like Jean Caffrey, nay Sheridan, you know, family, pillar of the community, huge businessmen, hugely successful. Tom Caffrey was a beautiful human being from my experience of him singing at 4 a.m. in the morning at a Cayley. But this, this embarrassing second family turned up and uh, I did what I could. I did what I could. The, the, they were so ashamed, like, they were so ashamed to be the hidden second family in England. But it's a very common thing. 
It's a very common thing with Irishmen. I don't know why. I'm, I'm Anglo-Irish. But the first Irish lad I kind of had a crush on age, I don't know what, 11 or something. Um, he went on to have dual families, a wife and kids in Ireland and a sort of mistress 